Hey guys, Britta here. Welcome back to Firefighting Simulator, the squad. Here we are for another episode, where I think we've only got one mission available at the moment. Uh, that's a one that we can change, or not should change. It's a random mission, but I think that one we have now is um, Flaming of a Dumpster. So we'll head on in and do that, I guess. Not sure. Hopefully we don't have to use this vehicle, because they don't... Yeah, we do. Uh, good on them. Good on them. Alright, let's just go straight in and do it. Because they're not going to actually help us with these fire extinguishers. I guess I can um, still get them to go and get new ones and bring them to me. That's probably a bonus. So this should be a reasonably quick mission, and then um, hopefully we can unlock another one. Otherwise, we might have to just jump on into a multiplayer game or something and see what we can do. Right, so we well, not that far away actually, only 700 meters. Okay, so one person needs to be rescued. Well, not rescued, but pretty cool. Assistance, so we'll have to sort that out first. I don't know why it's sending me this way, we should have went straight. Oh, oh, a bit of lag. Oh, that's a really bad traffic accident. Move a little bit. Thank you. There goes our fast time. Unit 1 to dispatch. Unit 1 approaching C. I hate the way the steering wheel goes, but I guess it might be better if you can use the control. Right, where are we meant to go? Straight here. Ooh, fire's on the right. Copy that. right there we go. 360 check. 360 check is bins on fire. There should be someone... Ooh, just there on the ground. Let's skip the 360 check because I'm not that concerned. Um, concerned about the victim. Let's go number one. I've got you back, boss. Go and get an extinguisher. Yes, number two, yes, get an extinguisher. Number I'm three, on. get an extinguisher. I'll pick this guy up. I've got your back, boss. I'm one, two, boss. three. You guys can all come yes, here. I'm on it. Yes, sir. I'm Wonder on. what that guy's doing. On a three um, there are people near the fire that need help. Yes, commander. You can sort him out. He's not really not injured or anything. He's just standing there. So hopefully he just dropped that fire extinguisher. Oh, he's still got it in his hands. So that's good. Victim is safe, boss. Right, so he's safe. He's safe. Quench all the fires. So where's the extinguishers in here? Let's go. Oh, look at this. Look at it go. Yes, commander. Yes, Commander. I'm on. Wow. It's a crazy fire. I don't know if we're going to need more than one extinguisher. Seems to be working alright, actually. Unless we can't get behind the bin, but we should. There we go. Easy as. Thanks for your help, guys. Um, yeah, wonderful job. Dumpsters are out. Let's give the guys a bit of a spray. Why is it spraying that direction? Doesn't matter which one I'm facing, it's spraying the same direction. Oh, I'll skip that. Instead of mucking around, let's go. Ah, running up that hill. Rosenbauer, command walk-in, rescue unlocked. So fast and fast, good. Went up a level, rescue two victims. Minute eight, minute 40. That's what I like to see. Nice, quick missions. So, running up that hill. Ooh, that's going to be interesting. Um, and the Rosenbauer thing is just the truck we unlocked. So, I guess that's our next mission. Uh, let's go. Command walk in rescue? I don't know what the difference is, but that's a new one, so let's drive that.
You can't enter a building through a door. Try going through a window. That's a pretty, um, pretty handy hint, isn't it? Oh, so it should be just all of us in the one truck, I think. Fire truck sirens and horn to clear a path. 360 check and establish the locations of victims, fires, or any potential hazards. Alright, let's go. Oh, 7.7 .7 kilometers. That's a different view, too. So I like that view, actually. Has this got, um... I don't think it has, like, um, sack hoses or anything, but it's got a ladder on the roof. This is going to be a fair drive. Come on, people. Let's turn our lights on so they can see us. Oh, cross the wrong button. Trying to leave the vehicle, what are you telling me? So, this might be an interesting mission actually. What are those things on the back? They look like lights or something. I don't know. Be good if we could actually, um, Turn it off and leave the lights on. Before they still get out of the way, because that'll probably make it less annoying for you guys if we don't have a siren. Yeah, they're still getting out of the way, so. There's a fire, you can see it off in the distance. Get up to 60 mile an hour. Get into top gear. Dispatch to Unit 1, copy that. Acknowledged, Unit 1 on route. It's a bit late to tell them that, like we're already two kilometres close to what we were before. It's 64 mile an hour. Come on people, get out of the way. It's good that we don't need the signs on the whole time. Still see our lights are moved, so that's that's a bonus. That wouldn't happen in real life because people don't know how to check their side mirrors and their reverse mirror, or the rear view mirror, I should say. I know with me being a, a truck driver, that's something that I um, I make sure I do. Like every five or ten seconds, I check both mirrors. I mean, probably even more often than that sometimes because you just never know what's around you, especially when driving a truck. Things come up on you pretty quick, so. Something I always do is, yeah, check my side mirrors, and because I do it in the truck so much, I do it in my car too. It's um, something I was taught you know, by my mum and my pop when I was um, learning how to drive and stuff like that, so... Right, coming into thick traffic now. So still just under three kilometers away. Definitely going to need the siren through here, I think. They don't seem to be moving out of the way. The guys in the right lane aren't anyway. Cross the wrong side here, turn left up here. Can't see because that pillar's in the way again. Right, so just over a kilometre and a half out. Another left hand turn. Oh, oh so close to that sign then. I have to leave our siren on through here because it's such a tight road. People, get out of the way. Left 
left hander. Right, a kilometre out. See the fire in the distance. Obviously it looked like um, it was way up the hill from the thumbnail. I guess that's why it's called running up the hill. Oh, people. Right, left hand turn here. Dispatch. Unit 1 approaching scene. Dispatch to all units. Unit 1 on scene assuming command. Continue working with fire. Where are we meant to pull up? Right out the front. Copy that. Right, I'll okay. do a 360 check. Okay, looks like there's a few cars up here too. Screenshot. What is it? It's on fire, like a campground, a campsite or something. That's interesting. How long is it going to take to do a 360 check though? Like it's all up the bloody hill. They're all going. Let's just skip it, otherwise it's going to take forever. Alright, where's our truck? Ooh, flags. Axe. Fry tool, circular saw. Nothing. No, we can't grab those. What are these guys doing? Do they get fire extinguishers? What's that? Like the command chair or something. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's go. Run up the hill. So that second guy is still doing the 360 check even though we've skipped it. Let's go, flashlight on. So I wonder if they're actually going to use the fire extinguishers this time because they don't normally. But they've grabbed them without me saying anything and they've taken off up the hill so... Potentially... Although I don't know where they're going. This guy is just like dawdling. Get up there and tell us what's going on. There's some victims here we need to know. Are they going to put the fire out? Uh, nope, you're just going to put, put it down and run. Right, so there's... Looks like there's um, some fuel canisters over to my left. Not even that close to it. Right, there we go. That's that's, that's um, done. That was interesting, sort of. Yeah, where were they? Just, oh, generators and stuff over there. So if they had it went up. That's a really weird spot for a fire. Considering there's no one around. Did we get the fast mission time? Oh, come on. Challenge bonus 250... Right, we didn't unlock any new missions, unfortunately. That's a bit of a bummer. Um, but nothing new. Let's have a look and see if we can... Um, S. McCready, smoke on the bungalow. Can we join this guy? I don't know if he's... Um, yeah, there we go. Can't switch trucks, not in command. Right, so I wonder if he's going to load straight in. Only the two of us. Don't want to wait too long. I don't know how it goes with um, looking for missions and stuff as well. If I can only look for people that are local to me, or if we can play all over the world, or if it, you know, like when it searches, because there was only the two games, how it actually works. Okay, so we've got McCready, myself, Killbox, and Digico. Let's go, McCready. Ready to go. Beautiful. Right, so we'll load in and get this one done and see how we go. Hopefully we can um, get this mission done pretty quick. Having, you know, human people help, it's a lot better than having just the AI. I don't know what the 149 means. 
probably like a gamer tag or like a, a group, I guess. It does take a little while to load in sometimes, and usually it's not too bad. Usually me, I'm the one that loads in slowest. Never a good thing. Alright, so loading in. Who's driving? Not me. No, we're in the passenger seat, so we're the boss. We're the boss today. Get off that one. Unit one to this one. We are on route to the sea. Dispatch to unit one. Copy that. Acknowledged. Unit one. Yeah, the other one's coming. Oh, get off the horn. Maybe all the four of us are in here. I don't know. Not quite sure. Hopefully this guy hasn't run into nothing. Looks pretty relaxed behind the wheel there, doesn't he? It sounds like we're going pretty quick. Whoa. Get on your own side of the road, mate. I think it's McCready that's driving. I think the, I think the person that's... Um, Bloody horn. Oh, get off the damn horn. Uh, the person that um, is the host is the one that always drives. Oh, Jesus. You know where that horn's going to get put? Dispatch right where the sun don't shine. I know how much I probably know you guys by hitting the horn so much. At least I don't hold it for that long, I suppose. So come into Lakeview Park. Alright, mate, we know. Oh, I thought there was a truck there, it just disappeared. This guy's flying. Actually, kind of scared. Oh, that was close. Had to be close. Should be straight ahead. I can't see the fire yet, but I think it's because it's multiplayer. It doesn't load in straight away. Unit one approaching C. Dispatch to all units. Unit one on scene, assuming command. Continue working the fire. What are you doing? Command, we've got electrical fires being relit by sparks. Find so that, that's around the, the back. Power. Is this one of the ones that's random or not? I can't remember. Alright, can we skip? I don't think we can skip. Maybe they're doing the 360 check. So the power box is just behind that little tent there. I know there's someone in that room in the back corner there. I'm not sure about the other rooms. Um, where's... I don't want a hose, I don't want a circular saw. Where's the pry tools? There we go. So where's the bungalow? We'll run around the back straight away and try and get the um, power turned off. It's just here. The victim in there. Breach the window. Oh, uh, will you breach the body thing? There we go. Oh, never mind, you get it then. Shouldn't say get it, but get her. I don't know if it's this lag or what it is. Oh. Maybe I should just go and get a hose. Traverse the window. So McCready's got one. Press tab, it brings up. 
what the current mission is to quench all fires, so it's like they've opened all the bloody windows. Got supply lines off both trucks going. Oh, he's got his hose ready. Let's get some victim put down. Is that all the victims? That's what I'm not sure of. Is that another attack one? Oh, so there's the attack hoses and stuff there too. Oop, got it connected to this first, don't I? Try and help while we're walking in. We've got victims in there. I think the victim's down that way, isn't it? I'm gonna put this roof fire out. Has someone picked him up yet? Did the victim picked him up yet? I don't know. I think there's an oil fire too, isn't there? Alright, all victims rescued, good. So I know we've done this mission before, but it's cool to be able to deal with other people. Tables just going up, something shocking. Well, hopefully, that'll put this side out completely. Need to try and get that little bit out, otherwise, it's going to keep spreading. There we go. for that fire on the stove. To try and cover his back here because that fire is coming around behind him. I don't think he cares though because he's getting hurt. The American flag didn't burn which is great. Save something. Right. So I don't know if there is a oil fire. I need to cool that right down. That was actually really cool. That looked really red. That um, oh, what do you call it? It's like the exhaust fan, range hood above the oven. Doesn't even look like there's any water coming out of his hose. Right, that should be this room. I think this room's done. about these guys. Do they need help? Ooh, looks like it. Oh, that's that done. Come and help Mr. McGreedy. Paint off the wall. Painting off the wall, I think. I wonder what else we can move. Oh, the hat moves. Someone's shooting out the window. Oh, that's me too, shooting out the window. 
Oh, radio guys. We'll um, we'll end the episode here after we get our um, stats, and hopefully we can go up another level and unlock some more missions for next episode. Yeah, beautiful. Next level involves structure and next mission. Good. Fast, fast. Challenge bonus plus 750. Good to see. All right, let's go disconnect. All right, yeah, guys. Well, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, as always, smash that like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the game um, and the series so far. And if you want to see more, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Bruto. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.